What's up, Racer X? And all you internet people, I'm Nate Adams. You're here at my house. We're kicking it in the garage. Um, also, it's the Deaf Family HQ, so uh, this is where we do all our business in and out of here, and, and uh, pretty much this is where the glove company started and it's still getting ran, so um, yeah. Just a normal day here at the uh, house, compound slash office, so we're just doing some Deaf stuff, getting our 011 stuff going, gloves and tees and this and that, and then uh, probably doing some riding a bit later, so. Uh, We'll go inside to the office and check out what Logan and Bubs are doing. Come on. So this is it. This is pretty much where it happens. We're all the creative design ideas. This is where we brainstorm. This is where Logan does. This is LD. This is Brian. We call him Bubs. And this is where LD designs everything, comes up with everything. This is where Bubs places orders, gets orders from athletes, ships out, puts out fires, all that stuff. So. This is where I come in to check up on them, act like I'm doing something. So, so this is it. This is uh, we got our gloves right here. Some of our T-shirts, our stickers. Um, it's pretty much what what we're doing right now, making quality gloves and trying to expand in the clothing and stuff right now. So, this is where it happens, man. Yeah, basically, I do. Uh, I handle all the creative side of everything over here. Just working on some new tees. Hopefully we'll have those out in Vegas, but basically everything just starts over here. Um, this is like kind of the production side of stuff we got going, a bunch of swatch books and stuff. Basically just starts from, I mean, we sampled everything from receiver gloves to golf gloves, you know, everything every we could have wanted. <laughs> yeah, every moto company glove basically just broke down what we liked and didn't like about them. And I mean, our gloves are pretty simple. They're super thin, super lightweight. Um, this is like our line right now for this year, which we will be expanding next year. We'll have a bunch more gloves, slip-ons. But uh, yeah, like this is uh, top material, you know, all our stuff's just sublimated. So all our work's just sublimated on our stuff. We don't got really any TPRs or nothing restricting the knuckles. That's how we like it. That's how everybody likes it, apparently. <laughs> So, I mean, basically it's just a lot of back and forth between us and China, just going, you know, switching up little things here and there until we got it basically exactly how we wanted it, real thin, and the fit's like okay. money right now, so yeah. it's fun, it's you know, it's, it's fun to watch it go from concept and idea, and yeah. now here we are, we got it. <laughs> from like the first club we got back, I was like, oh, oh man, yeah. I don't know if we're going to be able to do this. It was this. a long road at first when we first started this thing, yeah. our first gloves back were... Hurting. Hurting. <laughs> you would not I was actually to, pretty skeptical. Yeah, I just I'll, pulled the plug on the <laughs> uh, Maybe I can't pull this so off. Yeah. But. We're pretty proud of these these gloves, but what we've developed and pretty much Logan's designing and everything, so we're pretty pumped on I just want to say, because we always mention how they're like lightweight and they don't have all that TPR, but we've got Enduro and Desert Riding guys riding in them and, you know, like no holes, like no blisters, like they're holding up good. That's one of the main things I'm pumped on is our gloves is they're lightweight, they're what everyone wants and they hold up. Mm -hmm. And that was the thing I was most afraid of is we were making them so lightweight that they wouldn't. I just want to say that I've been talking to the Desert and Enduro guys and they're holding up too, so yeah. So yeah. Some t-shirts we're sampling, I mean, this is all like pretty new to us, you know, we are all yeah. just racers, freestylers. Definitely a learning experience. Yeah, none of us are really business guys, so this whole thing has just been like a learning experience for us. It's been awesome though, you know. Just every day, just learn something new and keep plugging away and people are feeling it. And a lot of people help us out, you know, Skull Candy Guy, Jason Kimball, um, the Ithaca guys. You know, there's a lot of people guy out there that want to help us, which is cool because some of the connections we made racing and stuff mm -hmm. are now paying off like really good and yeah. people are more than happy to hook yeah. us up. Never telling anyone like, off or burning bridges worked out for us. Yeah. <laughs> so it's fun. I mean, next year our line is really big. We got some crazy stuff coming out. <laughs> show them the new uh, stuff. We can't show the new stuff yet. <laughs> Bubs handles all the athletes. Answer emails, um, kind of like cover stuff. Help out Logan a little bit with design, like, you know, if, uh, he always asks me if I like it or something. And so give him my two cents. Testing out the new gloves. We'll have the new gloves this week. We're going to test them out and make sure they're awesome. Get something off the website. This guy packaged it. Right. You're unhappy with the amount of stickers I sent you? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing what I can. Well, this is our little production, our little operation, and we're pumped on it. And every day is like a little learn something every day, get stressed every day, get mad, get happy every day. 
It's one of those things. So it's cool. <laughs> it's like We're really enjoying it. Yeah, it's been a lot of fun. It's made me want to scream and makes me laugh and makes me smile a lot. So it's all good. It's a mix of everything. We're doing we're doing it and we're just learning as we go. It's been really fun. And when we get sick of it, we can go in the backyard and go riding. <laughs> yeah, like get away right from now. it. Like right now. Yeah, Let's go ride. Work. Let's go ride. I mean, a year and a half ago, it was just a thought in our head, and now we're all all three back here, you know, in the gloves. We got a buzz going in the industry, you know, Racer X is out filming us, like, it's all happening. And like we said earlier, it's just based on basically us, our, our personalities, us as people in the industry, we've gotten to where we're at with Death Gloves, all our connections and all the friends we've made through the years, so. It's just fun, it's exciting. Like, we got the office inside, and you know, we come out here, we test in the backyard. You know, we get, when riders are in town, our, our athletes, we get them over here for, for photos for their bio on the site just to have, you know, updated bios and pics. And it's just all happening, man. It's coming together, you know? It's fun. It's fun doing this stuff. Yeah, we got a good setup. And we it's nice it. to come out here and jack around and yeah. keep it fun. If we're, we're claiming that four riders buy riders, and this is it. If you don't get any more by riders than this. We're, we're riders. Look at us. <laughs> we were just whipping it for the camera. I mean, <laughs> it's like, not to sound cocky or nothing, but I mean, we're doing the one thing that we know the most about in life. Like, we know motocross, so we're making motocross gloves, so it's fun. I mean, we get to, get to have something, and you know, we've all like competed in this industry, been in it for like 10 years, but now we're making something, carving out our own niche, making something to call our own, to have maybe when we're, if we ever do retire, I don't know. <laughs> it's scary to talk about, but if that ever comes, we've got something else, you know, to keep us in the industry. Thank you to all our fans, because the gloves that we've sold so far have really been helping us, and the t-shirts, That's all. it all helps. So thank you everyone who's been supporting us since the beginning. It's been huge, so Death Family appreciates it. Talk me into showing you guys a sneak peek what we got coming out next year. Can't show you it all, but here's a little something, a little hand drawn, little easy robot we call them. Um, like I said, next year we got some crazy stuff planned. A lot of hand drawn graphics, a lot of detail. Slip on glove, strap glove. This stuff's gonna be gnarly. It's gonna change everything. That's all you can see though. Sorry. <laughs>